Now I just wait and watch for the UPS truck. Come on, buddy. Oh, he just went across the street. Fish made it. We're in the tent. Wesley's camping. Oh, man. Here they are. Holy moly. Holy moly. Wow. How many bags is there? I wasn't sure. Like, I mentioned a few types, but holy crap. Look at this. This is what I'm really talking about. Oh my god, look how many there are. Sweet. Well, I better get busy. We need more tanks. <laughs> Kitty, what do you think about the fish? You want some butter? Huh? Oh, There's a big ones too. Time to give them their bath. I can do this because I got well water. You can use aquarium water or jug water. Just YouTube search LRB fish bass. It'll pop up for you. Got a video that'll teach you all about these fish bass. Get these guys in their new home. Quarantine them off here. Boop. Enjoy, guys. Enjoy. More sentiences. And let's go, buddies. Lazy. Some chilling Thernia fasciata Clearwater Creek. A few bags of those. Quite a few of them little baddies. I guess we'll put them in. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's take a look at them first. So that would be wise, huh? Can't see much on them now. They look like they got some color. Stress, get them into the right tank too. These things will flare up. Just wait till they make it to the fish room. Y'all seen my rainbows before. What I do to them. We'll get them colors popping. I do have a few other types left, but we're gonna jump right into these. The Cernergos. These things are super super rare don't look like much now but like i said wait till i get them in tanks quite a few of these we're gonna get the king castle the dirty rascals You can't see it here, but it looks blue in real life. Get over there. You can see the root and connection to that bell. And always good to label things. That way there's no confusion. And these will only be in here for about a month until I can get them in the fish room. Because you got to quarantine your fish first. No matter what. Next up, Melinda Williams Creek. Quite a bit of bunch of them. Very nice. Oh, this one looks almost like red or something. I'm not sure. Could be because of their size. They got quite a bit of color on them already. This one's for all those who think that you have to do low stock to do no filter, all that stuff. You guys saw how many I put in there that are well over an inch. So inch per tank, this is a 10 gallon. Do the math. Next up, the Cato Rivers. 
These things are gorgeous. I saw some pictures of these. Oh man, just wait. These things are sick. Like I see blues and reds and stuff coming out on these with this camera. This video does it no justice. These guys are already lit up, but I can't pick it up. And last but not least, many of you guys have been waiting for me to get some of these, the Pygmaeus. You know, you know. That middle boy's already all colored up. They're all in quarantine. These guys are like, what is up with this place? Can't even see these guys. Where are they at? Wow. Where are they? They are completely hiding. Oh. Really blended. And you can tell with that sand. So these guys, these guys. I'll throw them a little food. See if they'll eat. If they eat it, great. Actually, I'll probably wait a couple hours. Let them settle. Let them simmer down. And we'll see if they're hungry. But I don't want to go overfeeding if they're not even hungry yet. Because that just cause problems off the bat. But thank you, thank you, thank you, Marcel, for the hookup. Appreciate you, bro. Look at this. Christmas and scrunchy. Sweeties. Aww. And eventually we'll get them in the fish room, we'll get them breeding, we'll get them going, get them displayed. And in the meantime, look up those names. You guys will not be disappointed on what these fish look like from the pictures and stuff. It's crazy. Oh, there they are. Some of my older bows. But if you guys watch some of my older, type in LRB rainbow fish. I'll show you some crazy, awesome rainbow fish. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Until next time, everybody. Peace. Have a great one. That's one of my all-time favorites. I hope to get more of those. Looks like a little standoff with this Madagascar here.